Happy push-up day, everyone. Uh, so the first push-up we'll be doing is a modified push-up on our knees. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going, going to um, tuck your abs in so your back is flat. And you're going on your knees. And I like to link my ankles just like that. Hands are under my shoulders. And I'm going to put my head in line with my spine. Go down to the floor and back up. And that's the first move. So you can do 10 of those. So the same as yesterday, you can do 10 reps of any of these exercises, taking a 20 second break in between, doing another 10 reps of whichever ones you want to do, taking a 20 second break in between, doing it one more time. So you're doing three different sets. The next push-up exercise is a regular push-up um, in a full plank position. So you come up on your toes, your legs are straight, uh, you're squeezing your glutes, you're squeezing your, your um, abdominal muscles, your hands are right under your shoulders. Once again, you're coming straight down at a 90 degree angle and back up. Down and up. Oh, my triceps are beat. Um, the next push-up is a diamond push-up. Um, so I'm giving you more than three different ones to choose from today. Um, the next one is a diamond push-up. This is going to work. Um, it's going to work your triceps a little bit more, and it's going to really focus on those, um, as opposed to if you do a wide grip push-up, you're working your pectoral muscles a little bit more. Um, so this, uh, the, the key is to keep your elbows close to your sides. So your hands are like this, and it's kind of awkward. It's really, it's really difficult, but you want your hands in a diamond on the floor, and you can do this on your knees as well, um, and that's kind of what I have to do in order to get um, very, very good and um, well, well done reps out of this, because you always want to focus on your form over um, the, over the difficulty level. So it's quality, not quantity kind of thing. So um, on your knees, you tuck your abs in tight, hands in a diamond, and you just kind of like drag your triceps down your side and back up. And those are, those are good. You can do like 20 of them and really feel a, burn, a deep burn in there. If you, um, if you have very strong triceps, you can actually move it up into a full plank position. Go down and up. As you can see, I didn't make it as far down on that because my triceps are not that strong. Um, and that's what we're working for. Um, we're doing this because everyone has a different starting point. And yeah. Um, and then next one, these are really difficult. It's a plyometric push-up. So um, we're engaging our fast twitch muscles in this. So it's keeping our muscles um, really up, I don't know, really up and um, aware of what is happening kind of. They have to stay on their toes um, in people terms. <laughs> and so you come up on your toes in a full plank position, go down into a push-up. It's like a clap push-up. You come up jump and you land. It's louder because like I said I'm on the second floor of my house um, and I also landed a little bit harder than I should on that one and that is because I am not quite strong enough yet to land comfortably in that position and hold it strongly. So I should go on my knees and do it like this and that's perfectly fine as well. So you have those four different modifications on your knees in a full plank position. You have the diamond in either um, the modified or full plank position, as well as the uh, plyometric push-up. Um, so like the jump push-up. Any of these can also be done against a wall. You can stand um, and do them against a wall, or you can kneel and do them against the wall. The biggest thing is making sure um, you keep your abs tucked in and your back straight. Um, also squeezing your glutes. You just want to keep your whole entire body tight and really focus on your triceps, your chest, your back, those muscles that you are working when you're doing these push-ups. 
Because the more you focus on them, the more they will work. So if you're focusing on them and thinking about what muscles should be working, your your form kind of follows that. Uh, if you if you ever think about like, okay, I'm supposed to be working my glutes in a squat, then you just naturally like kind of tighten them. And that's that's what this is doing also. Um, so quality, not quantity. Um, stick to what stick to what you know and what you're comfortable with and um, get the form. So it's form over difficulty always. All right, so I hope you enjoy these arm exercises today, and I'm looking forward to tomorrow as well. Keep getting feedback, commenting underneath the videos. I love in group engagement, and that's what really makes this group fun. Um, so please, please, let's keep commenting, um, posting things of your own as well, um, and let's have a great week.